Sheriff Tom Johnson here. Um, today, we really want to thank the agencies involved um, in apprehending the suspect. So Choctaw Police Department, Oklahoma City Police Department, U.S. Marshals and Oklahoma County Sheriff's Office warrant team apprehended the juvenile suspect involved in the shooting in Choctaw. We're not going to release his name at this time because he is a juvenile. Arrest warrant was issued for his arrest yesterday evening and law enforcement executed that arrest warrant. Um, the arrest was made without incident. And with that, I will tell you, um, all it says, it takes a village to keep a community safe. And all of these different entities that come together collectively to do that and accomplish this mission of keeping the community safe. This is truly why our communities are safe now because, you know, it is, it's not about one group, it's not me, it's we, and we, uh, I'm very proud of the organizations involved to get and apprehend this individual and um, the communication between all of us. So um, we're proud of what we did today, collectively as a group, and with that, I'll answer your questions. How did you all identify him? Uh, how, how is he identified as a suspect? Working together with these different individuals. They have techniques and, and things that they use and, and things that they can utilize. Um, and that's where that cooperation and that partnership is so key. That's why we need each other um, to keep the community safe. So that's how we were able to do that. Have you guys known who this was since Friday? I'm unsure, I'm not sure about that. Once the arrest warrant was released, that's when we know who When was the arrest warrant issued? Since the arrest warrant was issued yesterday evening. Okay. What uh, school district does he attend? I'm not sure. Can you confirm that this suspect is who shot and killed that 16 year old victim? That's an investigation. We know that the arrest warrant was issued and we apprehended the suspect. What's your understanding of. Who issued the arrest warrant? Choctaw. What's your understanding, Sheriff, of what transpired that night? Um, I know you can't, you may not be able to say a lot about this individual's exact actions or alleged actions, innocent or proven guilty officers, but what, for those of us who are watching at home, what happened that night? So um, I believe a shooting happened, but once again, that part of the investigation is being handled by Choctaw. Our Sheriff's Office only has the officer involved shooting portion of it, and then was tasked with the uh, more apprehension portion. So why are you all holding this press conference? Well, uh, because we need our citizens to know that there's a there's an end, you know, people want to know that they're safe. This has been going on for a while, and that's a lot of the questions that we get. You know, has this person been taken into custody? Are we safe to go to games? It's clearly everything y'all are running on every tele televised cast that y'all y'all push out. And so our citizens need to know that law enforcement is working hard, that has their best interests at heart, and that people are safe to attend games and to go do things, and that we're working hard in the background. You said you had the officer involved shooting component of the investigation, right? Sir, yes, what sir. can you tell us about what happened then? That is still under investigation. They're still working through all of that. Was what? it just one officer who discharged the firearm? still under investigation. What charges does the 15-year-old face? Uh, Ma'am, uh, I don't know, whatever's on the arrest. Yeah, that'll be on the warrant. I don't have the warrant. Have you all identified the 42-year-old man, and if so, what is his name, and where is he from? I haven't identified the 42-year-old man. Who was shot in the chest? Yes, I haven't identified him. Do we have an update on his condition? No, ma'am. I know you said that you identified this person through uh, cooperation and teamwork, but was it through tips, video, interviews? I think it's a culmination of all of that. I think our teams are, you know, you, you send these guys and they, they know what they're doing. They know how to find people. Uh, we can't give their techniques away because obviously that's unique to our profession and that's how we are successful. And so, uh, I think these men and women do amazing work, and, and that's why you know we took somebody into custody without incident. Let me try to clarify that real quick. So I think what she was asking is how was the suspect identified, not how were we able to find him with the uh, with uh, the warrant team? Is that accurate? yes? Yeah. Well, the arrest that would be a question. Yeah, that yes. would be a question for, for, Choctaw. for Choctaw. Okay. So why is Choctaw Pete not here? Sure. You all are handling the officer involved, mm -hmm. and they're handling the rest. We handled the arrest. We handled the arrest. Yeah, we handled the arrest. We picked, we picked up the suspect. Can you clarify the initial fight that broke out? We were told it was between two males, yet we're seeing now a 15-year-old suspect arrested. Was he involved in that fight? That's for Choctaw. That's for Choctaw, yes. You're going to have to get with them on that. Once again, we have the OIS portion of it. That's also involved shooting, and we conducted alongside 
the Oklahoma City Police Department, the U.S. Marshals, and our Oklahoma County Sheriff's Office warrant team pursued the warrant and uh, apprehended the suspect. So with that, Sheriff Johnson, real quick.